Hey guys, it's Jed here from Disrupt Tutoring and as always, it's such a pleasure to join you. Today we're going to deal with a number patterns problem and I'm going to get straight into the question. So they've asked us to fill in the missing number in the number sequence below. So the number sequence they've given us is minus 1, minus 4, minus 7 and then the blank where we need to insert the number minus 13, minus 16. So I'm going to rewrite this just so I've got a little bit more space. And typically, guys, we know that we have a couple of different types of sequences. We've got arithmetic sequences, which we will figure out um, if there is a common difference across the terms. And the other type of sequence we've got is a geometric sequence. And that will be a sequence that we will uh, find there to be a constant ratio between the different terms, the, the successive terms. And once we've tested for those two sequences, if we still don't have the right sequence, then we need to have a look at, at the sequence carefully to see if there's a special pattern that is involved. So let's start off by evaluating whether or not this is an arithmetic sequence. So the first thing we're going to do is look at our differences between the terms. So remember our difference is minus 4 minus minus 1. So we've got minus 4 minus minus 1. This becomes a positive. So it's going to be minus 4 plus 1. And ultimately, the difference there is going to be minus 3. And what we will find when we do it to this one as well, we'd have a minus 3 there, and we can see that there's going to be a minus 3 there. So that means that there is a constant difference of minus 3 for all of these terms as a constant difference. And that would mean the constant difference or the difference between this term over here and this term over here is also going to be minus 3. So we can write in the minus 3 and looking at minus 7, minus 3 is going to give us minus 10. So the missing number is going to be this minus 10 over there, which is going to be the missing number in there. And that will get you the mark for this question. Great, guys. I hope that one helped. Remember, we've got tons more videos at our website or on our website, so feel free to visit it. If you can't find the solution to your question, remember you can send your question to us and we will create a personalized video and send it back to you. A very special thank you to our sponsors for making this video possible. Read up more about them in the description below. And until the next time, guys, stay epic.